Hi everyone, I hope you are doing well. Today we talk about advertising and its techniques. First, what is an advertising? An advertising is a persuasive way of communicating a message to a large number of people. It's a major tool used to market products, services and ideas. It attempts to persuade an appropriate audience to adopt a belief or to make a decision to perform an action such as making a purchase or participating in a particular behavior. Advertising criteria Advertising is a paid form of communication. The advertisers must pay for the advertising to be produced and published. An advertising is non-personal communication. It's not a face-to-face -face presentation. It's only through written, spoken or visual means and not through persons. Advertising is using mass media such as TV, newspapers, radio, social media and others. Advertising purpose Informing Advertising is a way to inform customers about a product, a service or an idea. Persuasion means advertising uses different means such as images, texts, voices and many techniques to convince the audience to agree with a point of view to buy a certain product or use a certain service. Organizations of advertising industry The advertising industry includes different kinds of organizations but the main one are three, the advertising agencies. An advertising agency is a service business uh, dedicated to, to creating, planning and handling advertising for the clients. The advertising media means technological tools used. Are those technological tools in which advertising plays it to be published such as TV, radio, newspapers, uh, magazines and others. The advertisers, the advertisers are small local uh, company, less, small local businesses or large companies that produce a specific product and they pay for its advertising to be produced by the agency and to be published through media. Advertising pros and cons Some consider advertising to be useful. It contributes in creating job opportunities. Advertising industry contributes in creating jobs and rising personal incomes. Advertising is flourishing economy. Advertising helps businesses to flourish which is beneficial to the economy. Advertising is informing audiences about product. It is the most efficient way to communicate information about new products, their designs and their competitive prices. Other people see that advertising is harmful. They see advertising as a deceiving tool. Sometimes advertising shows the product in a good way and hits its defect. Waste of money. As long as companies spend a lot of money to make their product known in the market. Advertising is considered the main weapon that manufacturers use to create and educate consuming market for their products. The producers control and manipulate consumers to desire things for which they actually have no need. Advertising convinces the audience to consume more. 
by making them feel dissatisfied or inadequate by appealing their greed. Now let's see advertising techniques. What are advertising techniques? Advertising techniques are persuasive strategies, means ways to convince someone to believe a particular idea and adopt a new attitude. Among important techniques of advertising, we find the bandwagon appeal, means the audience should purchase products because of its popularity among people. Since everyone uses a particular product, you should do the same thing. Celebrity association or testimonial or also called endorsement means using a celebrity or a public figure to promote a product. Because celebrities have millions of fans who will want to purchase the product as well. Emotional appeal Appeal to people emotionally. It plays with the emotions of the viewers. Fear, sadness, happiness, excitement. For example, appealing the fear of the mother to worry about the best napkin uh, she must use for her baby. Humor. This technique used to present advertising that makes the viewers laugh, such uh, sketches, comic uh, and, the, and the tunes, uh, cartoons, get the commercial stick in consumers' mind in positive way and influence them into buying it. The anti-bandwagon appeal, it is the opposite to what the bandwagon hopes to. Uh, it tries to get viewers to think differently, celebrate one own style and uh, individuality, rebel against what everyone says, does or buys. Slogan they are easy, catchy words or phrases to remember. They are designed to be memorable. They are repetitive expressions. Slogan is a powerful tool to inspire the viewer into believing what the company is selling, whether it is a product, a service or an idea. Glittering generality. They are words with positive connotation attached to them. This technique is used for spreading a positive message or making people believe in an organization or a product. Product comparison. It focuses on uh, presenting two or more products with various specifications the products are pitted against one another and the negative characteristics shown and the benefits of a particular product are promoted. Repetition Repeating words or phrases, ideas, opinions, sounds and even images to make the viewers remember them and make the name of the product Stick with their minds, as repeating the word pots pots in the advertising. Weasel words, as I call it, kidba daina. It's a misleading advertising tool where the viewers are tricked into believing in some things. Oftentimes, a claim of research or expert opinions, statistics are also included to give the results a more concrete claim. Snob appeal, it aims to flatter, makes insinuations that this product is better than others, or even it is the best. Plain folks, 
it's a technique used to make a leader like common people or to show that a specific product can make certain audiences as normal people. For example, this product that can help uh, people who suffer from obesity to become normal. This is all in this video. Please wait for my last video concerning this module. Thank you and good luck.